Jesus is so unknown here in Israel, but yet people overseas are dying for him. They're praising him. They're being persecuted. Yep. We want to find out why the Christians believe in the Jewish Messiah. That's right. Why do Christians believe in the God of Israel, God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob? Let's talk to some people and see what they got to say. Let's do it. Let's go. So the question we have today is, why do you think that Christians around the world believe in the God of the Jews? Because the God of the Jews is uh, in the First Testament, and Christian believes in the First Testament. Basically, they believe in what continued from the Jewish belief. It's because we have like the same book. There's no other book. The oldest book in the world is the Jewish book. The it's about the Tanakh, of course. What do you want to believe in a yellow page or what? <laughs> because it's part of their their Bible too, no? Thinks it's because Jesus, maybe he was Jewish before. Maybe because Jesus was Jewish. I don't think they. Um, they think about Jesus as a Jew. I mean, they think they probably know or maybe believe or even because the evangelists, they really believe in the Jewish... Uh, That's right. And they support and love yeah, Israel. Yeah, and they love right? Israel and everything. But there are others who do not connect Jesus to Israel or to, to, right. to Judaism. So, Jeff, why do the Christians believe in the Jewish Messiah, the Jewish God. So in Isaiah 49, 6, we read, It is too trivial a thing that you should be my servant to raise up the tribes of Jacob and to restore the survivors of Israel. I will also make you a light to the nations that my salvation may reach to the ends of the earth. Basically saying the Messiah is going to be a light to the nations. Yeah, and in his salvation, which is what Yeshua, his, his Hebrew name actually means, is salvation that would reach to the ends of the earth, not just to the Jewish people. So we see a billion Christians around the world that don't come from Jewish ancestry, that have put their faith in the Jewish Messiah. Hallelujah. Yes, we have, we have fulfillment of, of Messianic prophecy. And I love how God says to Abraham that through your offspring, all the nations of the earth will be blessed. And we know from the first sentence of the New Testament, the genealogy of Jesus the Messiah, son of David, son of Abraham, that through Abraham's offspring, the entire world, all the nations will go. be blessed. Now we have it, Jeff. It's all there. Praise God. If you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a like, a share, and a comment. Subscribe, maybe. And subscribe. And we have a lot more content that you think you guys would love. A lot of street interviews. We got a great uh, playlist of Jewish testimonies. Yep. Go ahead and go watch those. And you guys have a blessed day.